Welcome back and good morning everyone. It is breakfast time at WDEF, that is for sure. We are talking to our friends from Bojangles this morning about how they are reopening in Fort Oglethorpe under new ownership. And joining us now to tell us all about it is Christina and Elliot. How are you guys? Great. Good morning, how are you doing? Doing great, thanks so much for being here with us. Thanks for having us. First of all, tell us a little bit. You just had the reopening earlier this week. We did, so we opened up the new ownership in Fort Oglethorpe, Georgia and we're happy to be there. Absolutely. Now y'all are excited. You have been working really, really hard and you've had some events that have happened already this week, but you're having some stuff that's going on today. Tell us a little bit about it. Yes, at 10 a.m. we have our ribbon cutting ceremony on site. The mayor will be there as well as the Chamber of Commerce. So we welcome anybody out to come and visit us. They're encouraging folks in the community to come by. You can have a great breakfast, but you're also having a lot of events going on tomorrow. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, so tomorrow is our grand opening celebration from 12 to 4 and we have all kinds of things going on. We're going to have the first 100 customers in line at 12 o'clock to get uh, a free breakfast combo and or a free lunch combo. Um, they're also going to be able to put in raffle tickets to win all kinds of prizes from Beats headphones to AirPods gift cards, all kinds of prizes. You have a chance to win all kinds of things, which is amazing for folks. They need to go check it out. And it's coming up tomorrow at what time? 12 to 4. 12 to 4, so go check it out, folks. You have an amazing spread here out on our table right now. Tell us a little bit, Elliot, about what you have up here. So we have our famous biscuits uh, with our sausage country gravy. Um, and we have an array of biscuits that we have here. We have a steak biscuit, bacon, egg, and cheese biscuit, our Cajun filet biscuit, sausage biscuit, and our limited time only pork chop biscuit. Now, these are my favorite folks. Mm -hmm. yeah, they, they're transformed a little bit for this time of year. These are bowberry biscuits, correct? Right. I have it right, folks. They've been around a long time. Yes. Tell us a little bit about them. So the bowberry biscuits are our dessert biscuit that we make our regular biscuits, but we put blueberries in them and we ice them and for football season we make them football shaped and we use our icing to make them look like laces. Some great ideas for tailgating this weekend if you're looking for some. We've got a great game that is coming up right here on CBS, the Tennessee Alabama game coming up at 3.30 I believe on Saturday, so some great options for tailgating. Thank you guys so much for coming on the broadcast today and telling us about reopening this new location. I know y'all are very excited yes, about it. We are. We are. And folks would like some more information, they want to come to the event tomorrow, how do they find that? Find it on um, cedartownfoods.com. They can come on out to the event. It's right in front of the Home Depot location Go in it. Fort Oglethorpe. Go check it out, folks. A lot of things are going to be given away, plus some free food. It's a win-win situation. It's also a win-win situation for Chip Chapman this morning because he's about to have a <laughs> glass of that sweet tea. Thank you guys so much for coming on the broadcast. We appreciate it. Thank, Thank you. you All right. If you would like some more information about this interview, please go to our website at WDEF.com. Stay with us. We'll return right after this.